Hello everyone. So today I'm going to show you how to make a painting using some string. And to do this you're going to need paper. You need at least two pieces of paper, uh, some cardboard or maybe a book or just something that you can press the pieces of paper um, with. And some string and this can be any string you have around the house and some paint or ink. So I'm going to use coffee ink and if you want to learn how to make coffee ink, check out um, our videos because there's one which shows you how to make it. So I'm using um, two um, bits of coffee ink and one is a bit more strong than the other. So one is a bit more intense than the other. Right, so what you're going to do, I'm just going to put the piece of cardboard aside for a moment and you want to dip your string on the ink um, and this ink is quite um, thick so I'm just gonna give it a little help so it soaks the ink and just then you're just gonna with your fingers just gonna rub it and pull it out just so that you rinse a bit of the ink otherwise it's gonna be too watery okay so you're gonna place it on your paper and just do a pattern any pattern you want it doesn't really matter. You can experiment with this. So, do your pattern with the string, and then you want to leave a bit of string in the end, just there. So, now what you're gonna do is grab a second piece of paper, and you're gonna lay it on top of the first one. And then, with your bit of cardboard or a book or whatever you got, Place it on top, then we're just gonna pull that string. And ta da! And it looks like a flower. Alright, I'm gonna do another one with the other ink that it's a little bit more watery. So same thing again, grab your string and dip it in the coffee. There you go. That's what you can do with just some string. So, I mean, you can cover the whole paper with different colors. I imagine that if you do one and then let it dry and then do just layer it like that, um, you might you might get a better result and more defined shapes because they won't smudge each other. So go ahead and, and try this and use whatever you have at home in terms of ink, if you have color things great or paint you can use acrylic paint um, you can use our coffee ink just whatever you have at hand go ahead and try this and share your creations with us um, send it to our email and we can share them on our social media thank you for watching guys i hope you have fun making some abstract art with strings goodbye